Welcome back everyone. In today's video we'll be diving deep into Ubuntu Cinnamon, the exciting new Linux distribution that's causing a buzz in the community. We'll compare it with the ever popular Linux Mint and discuss if it could potentially dethrone Mint as the go on beginner friendly distro. So without further ado, let's get started. First things first, let's talk about what Ubuntu Cinnamon actually is. Ubuntu Cinnamon is a remix of the well-known Ubuntu distribution featuring the Cinnamon desktop environment, which was initially developed only for Linux Mint. This combination of Ubuntu's solid foundation and Cinnamon's sleek modern design aims to offer users the best of both worlds. So what sets Ubuntu Cinnamon apart from Linux Mint? One of the main differences lies in the desktop environment. While both distros use the Cinnamon desktop, they each have their own unique customizations and tweaks. As you can see, Ubuntu Cinnamon offers a more modern and polished look. We have an updated icon set, which is in the current state of Ubuntu 23.4 beta, not finished yet. Here we have some old Advaita icons and on the other hand we have the new Yaru icons which are also the default icon set in Ubuntu with the GNOME desktop. But apart from the window theme and the different icons you definitely see the similarity between these two desktops. Which design do you like more? Write it to the comments. So let us come to a point where Linux Mint and Ubuntu are more different. When it comes to software and package management, both Ubuntu Cinnamon and Linux Mint have their own unique approaches. Ubuntu Cinnamon relies on the Ubuntu Software Center, which is underlying vanilla GNOME software, which is a great piece of software. Ubuntu Cinnamon uses the Snap Package Manager, which is significant for all Ubuntu flavors and also comes with the traditional APT package manager, which is quite disappearing in the desktop world of Ubuntu. So if you want to use Ubuntu Cinnamon, you have to like Snap. The advantage of Snap is that more traditional software companies use the Snap package manager officially, but Canonical, the company behind Ubuntu, has its hands over it and it isn't as free as many open source Linux users wish it. Linux Mint however uses the Mint Software Manager, which is also a very strong software manager, but you see in comparison to GNOME software on Ubuntu Cinnamon, this looks quite old. But the functionality is the same and the difference on Linux Mint is that Linux Mint uses also the flat pack management, which is the more open source like package manager, which also many other distributions are using such as Manjaro, OpenSUSE or Fedora by default. Ultimately, the choice between the two comes down to personal preference and which package management system you are most comfortable with. I personally tend to the FlatHub universe, which uses Flatpak. Let's talk about performance and system requirements. Ubuntu Cinnamon and Linux Mint are both designed to be lightweight and efficient, but there are some differences in system requirements. Ubuntu Cinnamon typically has slightly higher system requirements than Linux Mint, but both distros run smoothly on most modern hardware. If you are working with older hardware, you may find that Linux Mint performs better in some cases because of its higher RAM usage, on Linux Mint we are currently using 780 megabytes. On Ubuntu Cinnamon we are using over 1.2 gigabytes of RAM, which is a big difference here. Also a major factor to consider when choosing a distro is the community and support available. Ubuntu Cinnamon being a relatively new project has a smaller community compared to Linux Mint. However, it's rapidly growing and already has a dedicated following. Linux Mint, on the other hand, has a well-established and large user base, making it easy to find help and resources online. As Ubuntu Cinnamon continues to grow, it's likely that its community and support will expand as well. 
So is Ubuntu Cinnamon the new Linux Mint killer? It's hard to say for sure. While Ubuntu Cinnamon offers an exciting modern take on the Cinnamon desktop experience, Linux Mint still maintains its strong reputation as a reliable and beginner-friendly distro. Both distros have their own strengths and weaknesses. So it ultimately comes down to personal preference and what you're looking for in Linux distribution. If you're a fan of the Cinnamon desktop and looking for a fresh take on the Ubuntu base, Ubuntu Cinnamon might be the perfect choice for you. However, if you prefer a more traditional desktop experience and a larger community, Linux Mint may be the better option also for new Linux users. In the end, there's no harm in trying out both distros and seeing which one works best for you. After all, that's the beauty of the Linux ecosystem. There's always something for everyone. And that wraps up our comparison of Ubuntu Cinnamon and Linux Mint. We hope you found this video helpful and understanding the differences between these two distros. If you have any questions or thoughts, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more great content on Linux Guides. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.